Yo, what's up guys, Tuni here, back with another video, and today we're reviewing Railgun Chapter 132.5. Honestly, I wasn't going to review this chapter because it was so short. It was about 15 pages, but after reading it, I decided to share my opinions. Also, it's quite interesting to point out, so Railgun got the leading cover page of Dengeki Daio this month issue, so that's pretty cool. So yeah, like I said, not too much happens since it's such a short chapter. Next month it would be much longer. So yeah, this video would be pretty short and just straight to the point. So in the beginning, it was cool to see Misaka and Misaki first time interacting. Honestly, I really enjoyed how this entire conversation, they had the traditional stuff that they always going about, but actually Misaka was taller than Misaki when they first met. So Misaka was like, oh, oh, I'm taller than you. And then obviously the typical sauce, they weird. I, I mean, it's just there it really adds up to the character. So it seems like they've been doing it ever since they first met. So I respected the tradition. And there's like even a flashback. So Misaki does it like Misaka due to the whole like cloning the sisters of DNA stuff with the sisters right which is kind of we knew if you watch like real gun t read them i mean if you're reading this if you're watching this video you probably watch real gun t or read the manga obviously you know about sisters and the clones and misaka network and then dolly so yeah misaka did it as such a she really didn't know the impact that had on others and just the whole situation right but misaki doesn't like Misaka for that because like how can you give up this stuff to science and mess with this stuff obviously the information was so little at this time this is before sisters arc and all of that so yeah that's just kind of a backstory you could kind of guess that at this point but it was cool for like not really clarification but it was cool that they pointed it out and as in Misaki it's completely understandable but I guess there would be more character development down the road in this arc. I know too much didn't really happen, but I really enjoyed Misaki, and this is such a great introduction, because if you think about it, it's the first time she's introduced in the two-hour series. It may not be the first in the series, but the first in the timeline, how they first met. Especially during the arc, and especially during the climax, hopefully you can see a lot more Misaki. And then it pretty much ended off where they saw Rui again. It's weird seeing that, that's kind of like her older squad. You got the two people, her roommate, her older roommate, and the one who like start kicking the vending machines, Ruri. So I thought it was quite interesting. I wonder like how, like, cause like think about it, it's like a year or two apart from her curse girl, like Sa and Uiharu and Kuroko. So that's such a big gap, like seeing those people never seen before. So I wonder how they would end the arc to have it bridge between these new characters and new friends. So yeah, like I said, super quick video. I did not much to say, but honestly, I really enjoyed this chapter. I thought it was great. I wish it was longer because I enjoyed it so much, but we got next month. So subscribe, like this video, and peace. What you do, stay awesome.